Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hello, my name's Amanda and welcome. Today I'm just doing a, a haul. I've got some Harry Potter things, I've got some things from Kmart and Priceline. So if you'd like to see that, keep watching. <laughs> okay, so I was let loose in the shopping centre today. <laughs> <laughs> and so I grabbed some things for myself. Uh, I got, first I'll do the Kmart things. I'll leave the best part for last. Okay, so I got this Argan Oil hair mask from Kmart. It's a nourishing hair mask um, and it comes with a, it's a cream mask and hair cap. So that's pretty good. And that was only $3, I think it was. And I got this pretty phone case. Very tropical looking. got the most prettiest colours in it. So yeah, I thought I'd give that a go. Phone cases can be so expensive. I think this was only... It was only like $5, I think. Not even that. And then I got some nails that you can paint over. Design your own. I think that's pretty fun. I will never be as good as the um, the ones in the salon, so I think you've got to practice a lot to do that. We'll just be a natural at it. So that comes with 100 full cover nails, and they're medium length. And then I got, uh, oh no, hang on, that's, yeah, that was from Priceline, sorry. The nails were from Priceline and, yeah, this nail polish was from Priceline, Sally Hansen, and the colour is Brick Wall, so that's a nice, Ready, plummy sort of colour. So I'll give that a go. And then I got this is from Kmart. I got the U Euphoria eyeshadow palette. Isn't that a pretty tin? All their eyeshadow um, palettes come in pretty tins. I'll show you what that looks like. There's some really out there colours, some pretty colours. I'm stepping out of my comfort zone. I always wear, oh, excuse me, I always wear um, neutral colours. So I'm going to try. Some of these pretty ones for spring, summer. So yeah, I thought that was very pretty. And then I got some vit vitamin C and collagen day moisturizer. They had other um, products. This is the Kmart brand, um, Anco, Anco, so yeah, no harm in giving that a try I guess. It's paraben and mitt free, I have no, do no idea what mitt is. Hmm. 
so that will be nice. And I got some undies. <laughs> Don't think you'd like to see those. Okay, so now for the best part. I dropped into um, QBD books. And I went a little crazy with some Harry Potter stuff. Okay, I got the Harry Potter Pensive Memory set. How nice is that? <clears throat> the design of the box is really, really nice. And then this part here just clips open. You know, two little doors swing out. Whoop. And there you go. Yeah, I'll fix this up a bit. That's better. And that's a little wand, Dumbledore's um, wand pen. And then you've got the two little um, oh, um, memory vial things there. And then you've got the um, memory book what does it come with it comes with a deluxe 176 page memory book with pensive dish embedded into the cover the book features quotes from the harry potter films throughout and then a Dumbledore one pen, two memory vials with removable lids, and the keepsake box with closing latch. So, yeah, oh, that's, that's just really, really beautiful. I'm starting to get quite a quite a nice um, collection of Harry Potter stuff now. I'm, I'm trying to only um, collect uh, uh, like keepsake things, like um, props and stuff. I don't. I'm trying not to collect. Um, like the cartoon stuff and then I got this this is beautiful it's the letter um, Hogwarts letter writing set Hogwarts deluxe stationery set and that's from in insight editions It's just so beautiful. So we've got Gryffindor, Slytherin, Hufflepuff and Ravenclaw. And the nice Hogwarts crest there. And it comes with... Mm, this deluxe collectible set includes a 192-page ruled journal, a wax stamp and two wax sticks, 20 sheets of letter writing paper, tw uh, 20 envelopes and a paperweight, all of which feature the iconic Hogwarts crest. 
showcasing vibrant graphics and concept art from the beloved films. This finely crafted stationary set invites fans into the magical world of Harry Potter. So yeah, and then it's just got the picture of what's inside there. Lovely. Oh. And then I got the Archive of Magic, the Crimes of Grindelwald, written by, I think it's pronounced Sign. Bergstrom, designed by Mina Lima. That is so beautiful. Mina Lima are just amazing at what they do. Very, very amazing. I can't wait to get my signed copy of the um, Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. Um, I think it gets sent this month. So yeah, but I'll have to wait a little longer because I live in Australia. So it's got some props throughout the book. See if I can f find them quickly. There we go. The um, Ministry of Magic. Hang on, this is a bit awkward. Ministry of Magic identity card. How beautiful is that? And then we've got some more props. I think that's um Yeah, hang on when when Newt found out that Tina went to Paris. Oh, hang on. Hang on. Yeah, when Tina t Tina sent this um, postcard to Queenie, and that's how Newt um, found out she was in Paris. That's right. Wow, just look at, look at that one. He's got the Newt Scamander himself. There's another one there. Big Sir. Big circus banners. Oops. Yeah. There's heaps of stuff. So I'm looking forward to sitting down and having a proper look through that. And I, I only got this for, this was on sale. Um, it was $59.99, I got it for $14.99. So that was pretty good. Um, yeah. And that is it from my haul. I hope you enjoyed my video. If you did, please give me the thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel. Okay, take care everyone and I'll see you in my next video, which 
will be next week because I'm still waiting for my parcel to arrive. Um, it's a um, Australian subscription box. Um, yeah, so stay tuned for that video. Alright, take care everyone and I'll see you later.